Good morning. Just thought I'd go over the uh, SCX-10 deadbolt that I had bought for my son back, uh, not this last July, but the July before. Um, he had actually petitioned me to change his SCX-10 deadbolt into a uh, 1.9 Wraith, um, like I was driving, because he likes having a cockpit to put his little drivers in. So I happened to be on RCC and found a used chassis for sale. And I went ahead and used his deadbolt as a donor to put all of his parts onto this race chassis. Uh, there's very few that I've bought new for this rig. Um, there's a few things that we bought initially when, when it was an SCX-10, like the um, steel transmission gears. Um, I've since bought a few new LiPos to replace some older ones I've had. Um, and most of this is just stuff I've, I've either traded for, had laying around, um, or just happened to find. So far, I went ahead and did a quick flip hood mod with some uh, wire, excuse me, I think those are um, wire clamps. And just some aluminum sheeting and Velcro like I had done on my uh, previous 1.9s for the hood mods just to hold down the hood. And it works pretty good. Um, I have the uh, aluminum tray that he had in his deadbolt, his SCX-10 deadbolt, bolted up in here to hold his batteries. Uh, I tend to run 4,000, let's see, 4,100 mAh Echo Power 3S batteries, and they fit perfect in here. Um, I also run some um, 3,000 mAh 3S Turnigy LiPos that fit in there well. And it still has his original AE5 with a used BEC I had laying around. Um, I have a solar servo with aluminum horn. Um, it is running a whole, uh, excuse me, an RC four wheel drive uh, boost motor, 45 turn. Um, happened to find one of these used um, belly pans to put over the chassis. I had some links laying around uh, from various projects, solid and uh, all thread links. Um, these are actually two two RC four wheel drive wagon wheels with 1.9 trepidors stretched on them. Uh, I had some G made shocks laying around. Um, the little driver over there came with the rig with the chassis, um, but Spider Man was donated by a friend. Chassis itself had a few mods to it, um, and I happened to have an old fuel cell laying around that I went ahead, went ahead and glued in really good and made a remote tube and stuck it through these little bulkheads. He really likes it. It handles well. Uh, I think it's a little long in the front, and I may redo the links in the front to shorten it up some, but overall I think it's about a 13-inch wheelbase. It works really good. Um, he drove the living crap out of it yesterday, and he's just having a lot of fun. A few more little looks here. I'm going to flip up on the hood. See everything, all the electronics are nice and tucked up in there out of the way. So, there's a quick look, and we'll talk to you later.